Hello, good morning and welcome to my last weekend in Japan. I can't believe it's uh, soon over and I'm pretty sad about it but I'm also looking forward to the day today because I will go to Uji which is super famous for green tea and then I will go to Osaka. I already got all of my stuff ready. I'm currently waiting for my classmate to show up, get myself my breakfast, and yeah. Mm. Always good. We got some green tea rice soup for lunch and I let my green tea soak for too long and it made it taste so bitter, so don't make the same mistake. <laughs> oh, there's so many green tea sets. So earlier we just passed a cafe and I saw Vistiria blooming outside and I was just like oh my gosh maybe we should see if there's a park close to it and then we walked five meters and we found this. The wisteria flower is called Fuji in Japanese and yes, it sounds the same as Mount Fuji, which just shows how confusing the syllable alphabet in Japanese language can be. And in Japanese culture, they represent love and longevity, and we often see them used in art, poems, family quests, and formal kimonos. We are currently at Beauty in Temple, and I really have to admit that this is one of the nicest temples ever, and the temples around Kyoto just don't disappoint. Uji is famous for green tea and it's so much fun to try different kinds of green tea in the cafes or to buy some souvenirs for your friends and family. Oh my gosh, look at the super cool matcha ice cream machine. We got the hojicha one and I must say I really like it. <laughs> Okay, we are currently in Ujigami Shrine and it's so beautiful. I didn't expect this, but in Uji you can walk around quite a bit and see so many shrines and temples and then just stop at the really delicious cafes and get some matcha, matcha sweets, green tea and everything else with matcha and green tea, which is so cool and it's still such a cozy vibe here. Check out this super great looking strawberry matcha drink that we got. Ah, it looks so delicious. Mm. It doesn't only look good, it tastes, tastes so good. Uji matcha takoyaki. I don't want to hate on my food, but uh, the Uji matcha takoyaki doesn't look that appetizing. <laughs> Really good. It's like matcha mayo. Just found this super cool anime looking car and I just learned that you call them Itasha. Yeah. Which kind of means it hurts to look at the car because most people find it cringe, but I think it looks so cool.
We are climbing this random mountain right now to find a shrine and it doesn't look really promising. At least we found a super beautiful graveyard. We just realized that we already passed the shrine that we wanted to go to. There were no restaurants that uh, gave us a spot. I don't know if they were crowded or not that foreigner friendly. <laughs> but we got some stuff at the uh, supermarket and just did a little um, picnic here at the river. It's also pretty peaceful. Mm. And then I think later I would just catch the train to Osaka. Thank you, Uji. It was great.